Nice. Uh, where are we? Archie on Instagram. Which AFL game has been your most memorable in your 100 games? Most memorable? Um, there's been a few good ones. There's uh, a couple of really um, amazing comebacks from us. The, I think of the showdown a couple of years ago. and um, Certainly the game against Richmond at the Adelaide Oval last year in the elimination final stands out as well. Um, and also the semi-final against Frio over in Perth was a ripper as well. So been lucky to play in a lot of great games over the last few years. Nice one. Nice one. Uh, Rachel in Instagram. So she's not on it. She's actually she's in, in it. it. Yep. Um, that's really cool. Well done, Rachel. Uh, can you sing Never Tear Us Apart for us? I think you can. I've heard rumours that you are quite a nice singer. I've heard it firsthand, actually. Um, Look, take the, take nah, the nah, I, w I won't do it here. Um, but keep an eye, keep an eye on me before the first bounce at the games at Adelaide Oval, and I tend to sort of, yeah, I get into it a, a bit. Yeah, I start singing along, so keep an eye out and maybe an ear out, and you might be able to hear me there. Oh, there's about fifty thousand other people singing <laughs> that song as well, mate. But we'll see how we go. Uh, Sam on Instagram, what's your favourite jelly flavour? Jelly flavour. No, I haven't had jelly for a little while, but um, I just, you know, raspberry, anything that's sort of red, strawberry, raspberry. It's not, that's a, I like it. Fair call. Cool, uh, we've got someone that you may be related to, yeah. uh, Carol Hartlett. Do, do you happen to know a Carol Hartlett? It's the old girl, yeah. I thought so. How much do you love your mum? Oh, I love mum. I love mum a lot. Um, probably uh, don't express it to her enough, but uh, I think she knows deep down that she means the world to me, and uh, um, I hope those those feelings are reciprocated as well. Love you, Mum. Do you reckon you're the golden child? I know I'm the golden child. She's told me, and she's told my brother and my sister as well that I'm the favourite. Yes, that's what we like to see. <laughs> uh, Adriana on Instagram. How many wheat bix do you have? Um, usually only sort of five or six. Yeah, disappointing, but. Um, yeah, they fill me up a bit wheat bix so only only sort of five or six with a little bit of honey. Is it Brett Lee that does like 30? Yeah, someone does like a ridiculous amount. I think, yeah, my, my brother used to do sort of 12, 13, but I must have a small stomach. I can only do the five or six. Seems a bit over excessive. Um, Nick on Instagram, who did you support growing up? Uh, I was a Crows supporter. Um, being a 90s, yeah, 90s baby, I... Uh, there was only one team in the AFL um, back then, so uh, I was a big Crows man sort of growing up and then um, a little bit of Carlton sort of towards the uh, you know, teenage years as well. Uh, Carly on Instagram asks, who was your inspiration as a kid to, that led you to football? Um, you know, in a football sense, it was Tony Modra uh, from the Adelaide Crows. He used to win number six and take, take hangers and... Um, and kick some nice goals as well. So Mods was my footballing hero, but you know, just my whole family, uh, particularly my, my dad and my brother, who I used to kick the footy with um, in the backyard all the time. They were you know, my two biggest inspirations, I suppose, growing up. Lovely. Uh, Whitney on Instagram. If you could eat only one type of food for the rest of your life, what would it be? Um, I've got a bit of a sweet tooth, so anything that's packed full of sugar unfortunately yeah chocolate um, ice cream uh, caramel sauce I love yeah I, I just love everything with um, with a bit of sugar in it unfortunately so that's probably me. Uh, and our last question comes from uh, teammate Jack Homsch yeah. he wants to know what his chances are of winning the bachelor this year <laughs> um, well he's got to do a little bit more promoting and, and advertising of himself um, a bit more than what I did last year. Uh, you know, congratulations to Homer for, for being nominated for um, Cleo Bachelor of the Year this year, mate. I know you you'll, uh, you'll do a great job. You know, get get that great rig of yours out as much as you can, mate, and um, and just you know speak your heart. And I'm sure the uh, the ladies will be um, head over heels for you, mate. So all the best. And that's it, boys and girls. Thank you very much, Hammer, and uh, we'll see you next time on Team Talk.